I'm Li Hui Cai. I'm a neuroscientist. I'm a professor of neuroscience at MIT and the director of the Picor Institute for Learning and Memory. I remember growing up as a girl loving science. I never feel uh, a problem. I never feel boys and girls are different. Um, and then uh, even, you know, after I studied my PhD program and uh, postdoctoral training, um, I would say that um, men and women are pretty equal, at least the number. But then, you know, um, as I um, advanced through my career at different stages, all of a sudden I realized that, you know, there are fewer and fewer and fewer women. Um, and at my level, I would say um, it's, it's kind of rare. It, it is hard to really point your finger and say, ah, because I'm a woman, because, you know, I'm an Asian, so, um, you know, I'm out of the pictures. Although if you ask me whether I feel because of my race and because of my gender, that I, you know, I'm not viewed uh, equally as some of my other peers, I would say, of course, I feel that way. I teach. I also am a, I'm a director, so I have a lot of administrative responsibility. But um, bottom line is, I'm foremost a scientist. That is where my heart is. The rhetoric about Alzheimer's disease, we all know that it's, um, it's a problem. That more and more people are getting um, either Alzheimer's disease or other type of dementia because of the aging of the society. My grandmother had dementia, probably Alzheimer's. Um, that was, you know, almost half a century ago, so no one really knew. That's another factor. But really, I sort of feel um, studying Alzheimer's disease actually help people to understand how the brain function. I'm going to devote the rest of my life to try to provide more understanding to the disease. And if in the process, some sort of therapeutic intervention approaches can be created, that will be even better.